Hi. Well, someone asked me to make Gojo transition tutorial for more than a month. Like, for real. Well, this is Gojo transition tutorial, but it's not. Like, this video was supposed to be watch me edit video. But I couldn't record the video I thought I was recording because of my disk space. So, I made a remake of Gojo's edit, which is Lifeline Edit. <laughs> I will leave the project file in description if you want to check it. Yeah, I will try to explain how I made this edit transition and this tutorial like isn't for beginners. Like I will just yap and explain what to do to make each clip I made. All right, so for the first clip here, I just did simple transition, zoom in, then fake zoom, like a little bit out, then zoom in again. For the second clip as Gojo did, I freezed frame the clips and put it over first clip and I mask the second clip, and animate the mask expansion, and position and scale of it like this. And for the original unfreeze clip, I did zoom in transition, then I pre-comp both of the clips and add time slice effect, and that's it. The third transition, Gojo did circle, coming from the second clip. Then, inside of it, the third clip comes, so I tried to do the same. I made a circle shape, and tried to animate, as Gojo's one, and went to third clip, and made zoom in transition, and I pre-compose it. Then I masked it, and animate it to be inside the circle I made, so it looks the same. Then I pre-composed them both, and made fake zoom in, and zoom in transition. In the end of the clip, the next clip, it's just zoom in, and fake zoom out, and then zoom out, in the end of the clip. For the fifth clip in the first null, I did zoom out, then fake zoom, and zoom out with position. Sixth clip, zoom out with position, and then seamless face zoom with the next clip, to make it adjust the next clip when the face is zoomed to match the first clip. Then, match both of the clips, with a null, and make a transition. Zoom to face, and the face zoomed clip. I did fake zoom, and then zoom out with position. And the eighth clip, zoom out with position, and fake zoom out. Then zoom in. And then I pre-comp the clips from fifth to eighth, and add time slice effect, and tried to make it like Gojo. Then in the end of eighth clip, the ninth clip is zooming in with mask, and in the start of it also zoom in, then zoom. The next clip is, just simple, zoom out. Zoom in, and fake zoom, with time slice between previous clip. The 11th clip, zooming in with mask, 10th clip, and zoom in, in the start of it. And fake zoom, then zoom in. Then here, I tried to make the heart tunnel transition like Gojo's one. Well, I started with adding a solid and add 3D stork effect on it, and I made heart shape with pen tool. It's easy, just press alt when you're using pen tool, and try to make it, or get a heart shape, PNG. Because right now, I will pre-comp the solid heart shape, and use auto trace to get masks. So we can make 3D heart shape by adding another solid layer and copy and paste masks here. And I add element 3D and throt custom layer, custom text and masks. Choose my solid layer and masks, then scene setup and extrude. Here the heart shape shows and you can choose any bevels presets. You can I use. I choose random one and changed color to red. Then I add shatter effect to solid layer and changed settings to these. You can copy them and add deep glow. Then I add a camera and nulls to the camera and duplicated solid layer of the heart, many times, and change their places by changing position Z of element effect in each one, and add the clip masked it with heart shape, add mask, expansion keyframes, and then I animated everything with nulls. And that's all what I did in this quick remake? Well, if there's anything you didn't understand, tell me in the comments and tell what do you want for the next tutorial. Thanks for watching.